Hey guys, welcome back to Huntress Healing. Uh, today's deck walkthrough is going to be the Lightseer's Pocket Tarot. I am so excited for this deck because the Lightseer's Tarot was one of the first tarot decks that was gifted to me by my friend. Um, it's a deck that I use frequently for my readings. Um, and I've always wished that I had a smaller version to like carry around in my purse that just didn't take up so much room because like having kids myself, um, and just being very busy on my feet, it was hard to, uh, <laughs> say, you know what, I'm going to have room for my cards in my purse when we go out, um, or whatever I'm doing. So I'm really excited about this one. Um, if you have not seen the Light Seer's, Seer's Tarot, it's a 78 card deck. It, is a healing tool and guide to explore both the light and the shadow sides of our nature. The Light Seer's Pocket Tarot is an ideal companion as you seek to uncover the places in your life and in yourself that are the most need of illumination. Oh my goodness, it's like it's so cute because it's itsy bitsy. So we have our tiny little guidebook. So the difference in the guidebook, uh, the first thing I noticed from the other one is that they eliminated the picture of the cards in there, but I think that's just to make it smaller because, I mean, it's a pretty thick little chunky guy here. So let's go ahead. We're going to get started. And I'm going to zoom in because you can see just how small, like here's my hand and here's the stick of cards. So there, it's definitely a small deck. So I'm going to zoom in so that you guys can get a good image. It has the same pattern that the full size deck has on it. And it is nice and itsy bitsy. This is absolutely one of my favorite decks. The colors are very vibrant. There's so much passion in the pictures. Like I, I recently went digital with all of my, um, oh, sorry, distracted. I love the stuff card. Um, I went digital with all of my uh, tarot reading journals and I went through and I love this deck so much that I turned all of the cards into stickers so it was super easy to record my journals and good notes <laughs> but yeah I absolutely adore this deck I don't feel like any of the symbolism is lost from going from the full size deck to this size which is something I've seen in some of the other decks that I've had Oh my gosh, I just love this. This is one of my favorite cards. It's just, you can see so much passion. I also love this Four of Swords card because when I see this, it's like, it's time to rest. <laughs> like, you just need to chill out. I have a funny story about one of uh, my Pentacles cards. Um, it disappeared for a while out of my deck when I first started and I had no idea what it meant. And one of my friends had actually come over and I had let her uh, do some readings with my cards and I didn't realize that the card had fallen out and like down underneath something. So when I was cleaning and like finally taking care of some stuff um, and working on taking care of me, it popped back out from like underneath something. And I was like, oh my goodness, where have you been? Um, so the cards do find a way to speak to you, even in the most unexpected ways. All right, guys, that is the Light Seer Sears Pocket Tarot. 
Um, thanks for hanging out with me and I will talk to you again soon. Bye.